What's up, Uber Nation? Bronze to Elite Challenge, episode 13 live. We are going up against the New Orleans Pelicans here, and uh, we got a new player um, as we look at our other lineup here. We have the man, the myth, the legend, Mr. Chef Curry, also known as Steph Curry. Um, you know what? I just, I just decided to go with him. We had him in our reserves uh, for a while since we packed him, and uh, you know what? I didn't... You know, we could have probably upgraded Aldridge. He didn't do much last game. Uh, but ultimately, I uh, ended up going with Curry just because he's sitting on the bench. I mean, why not just go with our best player? Uh, one of the best players in this game. And let's uh, look at his numbers real quick. Uh, for those of you who don't know, most of you guys probably already know. We also have that impact Damian Lillard, which is nice. 86 speed, 89 dribble, 94 three-pointer, 77 shooting, 69 defense, 85 passing. Absolute savage beast. And uh, we're going up against the young New Orleans Pelicans squad here with Eric Gordon, Alonzo Gee, Anthony Davis, Omer, Omer Ashik, and uh, Norris Cole running the point guard position there. So um, they're growing, they're growing, but they do have an absolute superstar stud in Anthony Davis. Um, by the way, that's a card that we, we should probably try. I don't think uh, we've ever done a gameplay with Anthony Davis as we get... Oh, <laughs> let's go! As we get a turnover here and CJ McCollum just smashes on Omar Ashik. If I was you, Omar, Omer, Omar, whatever your name is, you should just retire. You just took that L hard. He just took a monster L as I'm getting a notification here. Lots to worry about while I'm recording here. And let me move myself further up in the corner. Oh my goodness. My buddy Brett is texting me. Uh, we're going over some fantasy uh, football lineups. I have a pretty good one going right now. I got Andrew Luck, Dante Moncrief in a lineup paired together, and uh, they're doing pretty nicely. Uh, not sure how much time is left in that game or if it's over, uh, but man, McCollum just smashed on Omer Ashik. Omer, Omer Ashik? I cannot say that guy's name. I used to be able to pronounce it. I, I Somehow I lost it. Oh, Eric Gordon, who's always been a pretty good sharpshooter. When healthy, 2-2 two -two ball game, one minute to go here, and there is the man. Mr. Steph Curry, let's see if he can... Oh, ho, 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 ho. that's not even fair, guys. That's not even fair. If we do this all game, it's going to be ugly. It's going to be super ugly. And uh, let me ask you guys something. In the uh, Let me know in the comments here. Ooh, as we run the court, and that was an ugly shot. What was that, Plumley? Um, so we have uh, about 15 of these uh, season veterans uh, collectibles. And you, I think you need 20 and a couple of badges. Uh, oh, out to Curry. Let's go. Money couple of badges to get a uh, seasoned veterans player. Now, are those players elite players or are, are there gold players as well? Or are you guaranteed an elite there if you get that? And also, are they auctionable or not? Um, and let me know what, what some of the seasoned veterans uh, players you guys have pulled are. Um, I'm just curious. I've never done that set. I've never completed it. Um, as you guys know, I usually always play with this two-way squad. So oftentimes, we don't get the collectibles. Um, but, uh, yeah, I'm just curious. I just noticed that we have about 15 out of the 20 needed. So, um, oh, you know, that's going to be money. Let's go. <laughs> that ain't even right. That ain't even right. We're up 11 to 2 here in the first quarter. And now, now it's going to become, this is going to get fun. Ooh, Anthony Davis with a buzzer beating shot. He says, you know, don't forget about me. I may be the lone superstar on this team, but I'm pretty damn good. Um, but yeah, this is where it's going to get fun, where we're going to start upgrading into an all-elite squad. Uh, barring uh, we don't blast through our coins uh, like we did this morning and not pull any uh, any good elites um, anymore. <laughs> In that case, it's going to be extremely difficult for us to buy uh, elite players on the auction house because uh, we had a pretty rough pack opening. We spent a million coins and uh, got the Hassan Whiteside twice. <laughs> As Eric Gordon uh, dashes through the lane with a nice slam dunk here. Second quarter, 6-11 to 11 the score. Chef Curry doing his thing, punching it out to Mr. Plumley uh, with an ill-advised shot. I shouldn't have shot it from there. That was bad bad on my part. Um, I'm holding my phone kind of weird, so that's I think that's causing this. I'm never trying to... Um, trying to have my hand over the microphone. That's That's the main thing. And here's that step back cheese, but he doesn't get it to go. I think uh, Curry misses his first shot there. Uh, maybe we should get some of these other players involved. Joe, Joe Johnson hasn't done a whole bunch in this game yet. 
Uh, we still have him on our squad. Uh, LaMarcus Aldridge hasn't done much. Uh, CJ McCollum absolutely destroyed the Pelicans' front court in, in the first play of the game, pretty much. But aside from that, he hasn't done much either. So we need to uh, get going here, get some of these other guys going. Here's Joe Johnson. He's been nice for us, and he's going to make that all. Oh, I thought he was. Plumley though, with the rebound and the putback. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. The fellow Blazer here. This is actually a pretty nice squad, even though it's got four golds. I mean, um, I would argue this this is a better squad than uh, if you have some of the low-end elites uh, that may not play as well. You know what I mean? I mean, there really isn't that much of a difference between 83 gold and an 84 elite, right? I mean, it's it's pretty close if you, if you look at the numbers. It's pretty close. Uh, we're trying to steal the ball here from Norris Cole. He's a pretty good defender. I don't know if he's a, a good shooting point guard. He's, he definitely can't really create his own shot, as far as I know. And there's Aldridge running the court, giving it out to Joe Johnson, who's going to go up for three and make it. And now Joe Johnson's heating up here. 16 to 8, the score with 16 seconds to go. And uh, once again, let me know what position you guys want to see upgraded, what player you guys want to see. I'm thinking about uh, upgrading center. And I already have a player in mind next if we win this game. Hopefully we do. Oh, we we don't let the ball go in time, I don't think. But it didn't matter anyways. We didn't make it. So halftime here in Portland. 16 to 8. The score against the visiting uh, Pelicans of New Orleans. And uh, hopefully we can come away with a victory here. Uh, we should be able to. We should be able to. I mean, we are probably favored to win, right? As Curry... Uh, tries to make a contested shot there we try to get the rebound but Anthony Davis is just so long that long wingspan really comes in handy when you're trying to tip uh, those rebounds to yourself oh nice bucket there who was that Alonzo Gee Alonzo G Alonzo Gee whatever the name uh, you just made a nice bucket there that was really good uh, Curry is uh, get cooling off a bit a little bit of a heat check early on, but he's cooling off a little bit. And there's Plumley running the court again, trying to go coast to coast. Um, out to McCollum for deep. And once again, in and out. We can't get it to go. We lost our touch here. Lost our touch. We're, we're throwing up some Hail, uh, some Hail Marys, though. So I don't, you know, I don't expect those to go down. And that was just a terrible pass into no man's land. Now we're turning the ball over. Guys, they're going to come back on us here. Oh, good spin move. They're going to come back on us if they can make some shots of their own. Oh, with the spin and the dish. Oh, and then we totally fumbled the ball here. Come on, get it. Get it. Hustle. You see that? There was more hustle by the Pelicans than uh, by Joe Johnson on our team. Uh, luckily, we got the ball back. But, man, that didn't look good. Didn't look good. If I was the coach, uh, I'd make Joe Johnson do some push-ups or something. Let's go. Plumley with a good bucket. Get yours, big man. Go to work. That's what I'm talking about. And sorry for sniffling, but I still I still got a little bit of a cold. I should get over it soon, though. Fadeaway three-pointer. Those are never high-percentage shots. Uh, and we're going to dish it off. CJ McCollum dishing it off to his teammate, Plumley, who's absolutely heating up with a nice bank shot. The bank is still open, even on Sundays. That's what I'm talking about. 20-10 to 10 the score here against the Pelicans in the third quarter as... It's winding down, and we get another... Oh, I was going to say we get another steal. Omer Ashik doesn't even want to go under the hoop anymore after getting absolutely annihilated by CJ McCollum earlier on in the game. First play of the game, that was. That that couldn't have built his confidence up. And there's Joe Johnson. He's just going to go up for it. Let's go! 23-12, 11-point game with five seconds to go in the third quarter. Let's go, guys. Yeah, I think I want to upgrade the center position. Although Plumley has looked really nice in this game for us. He's looked nice. That's the campus hero Plumley card, of course. Um, I do have Boogie Cousins uh, as a reserve on this lineup. And I also have Damian Lillard. So if Curry, if we get tired of Chef Curry, which I don't anticipate happening, but uh, we may, we may bust out uh, Impact Damian Lillard. When I completed that set, I didn't realize it was for the two-way lineup. So that kind of sucks since we have Curry. But, oh, take it easy. Omer Ashik with a deep three-pointer, I think. Wow, that was nice. And we're going to do some dribble moves. Get Oh, got by the defender, but he caught up. Now we're just mad. We're going to shoot it long to ill-advised. Terrible shot. 
absolutely horrendous. Give me the ball back here. Plumley trying to steal it from Anthony Davis. Can't get it to go. Let's double team this guy here. Alonzo G, who had a nice bucket earlier. Come on, CJ. Come on, CJ. Give it to CJ. Give it to CJ. I need you to posterize somebody else. Oh, no. He doesn't get through. He almost turns it over. CJ is trying to posterize everybody on this team. That's what I'm talking about. Let's go. Give it to Curry. He's going to make that. Come on. Money. Oh, no. We're so far off right now. Curry really can't get it to go. Curry is uh, cooking up. Chef Curry is cooking up a, a hot turd right now. A dumpster fire of a meal. Ooh, there's Anthony Davis. And he's... Ooh, ho, 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 ho. He just owned it. And they're coming back. Oh, no. No! They're coming... <laughs> they're coming back on us hard. What is going on? 23-19, guys. We got to get our act together here or we're out. We're going to lose our first game of the season. No, we're not. Let's go. CJ McCollum with the layup. 25-19. We're up by six. Under a minute to go. Wow, but the Pelicans were storming back here, um, trying to show us that they are forced to be reckoned with here. Don't forget about us, they say. And Aldridge running the court, and he's going to smash it. And that's the dagger right here. Welcome home, LaMarcus Aldridge. Finally, you're doing something for us here. I, I'm, I'm leaning towards upgrading the power forward position, actually. Although we have Boogie Cousins on the bench, we might bring him up. Might have to bring him up. 22 seconds to go here. How many more points can we make with Curry? How many three-pointers? Can we hit two? Here's a fadeaway. Oh! Oh, so pretty. Oh, it's so pretty. When you got Curry on your team, even if it's a tied ball game with a minute left, it can still turn into a blowout by the end of the game. I'm telling you right now, guys. That guy is that electric. Ooh, and that, was, that looked kind of glitchy right there, but um, nice bucket. We're just going to go for it from half court here. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, I, th I honestly thought he's going to make that. I'm going to try some more trick shots like that. Now that we have Curry, it's pretty fun to play with him. So we win 30 to 23, guys. That means we're going to get one more elite next game. Um, hopefully you enjoyed this video. As always, smash the like button if you did. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already. Share the channel uh, with a friend that helps me out a bunch. And uh, comment below, who do you want to see in this lineup? Uh, again, it's a two-way lineup, so keep that in mind. Not all players are available for, um, you know, certain lineups, especially when you're looking at some of those special edition cards. Um, the base elites are all available across the lineups, but some of the special ones aren't. So keep that in mind, guys. Let me know what you guys think. And uh, once again, thanks for watching. Enjoy the rest of your Sunday. And until next time I'm out, mahalo, everybody.